Jay Leno is taking legal steps to protect his wife Mavis Leno's financial assets amid her battle with dementia. The former host of The Tonight Show files for a conservatorship of his wife's estate in a Los Angeles court on January 26, according to legal records obtained by E! News. According to NBC News, the TV personality's petition seeks a substituted judgment to approve estate planning and implement a testamentary plan that he believes his wife would execute if she were capable. Stating in the docs, Unfortunately, Mavis has been progressively losing capacity and orientation to space and time for several years. As Mavis's current condition renders her incapable of executing the estate plan, Jay has petitioned the court to be appointed conservator of Mavis's estate for the sole purpose of filing a petition for substituted judgment on her behalf in order to ensure her desires concerning the disposition of her assets upon her death are realized. According to NBC News, Jay states in the petition that he believes Mavis consents to him being appointed conservator of her estate. Records show a follow-up court hearing is set for April 9th. The couple have been married for 43 years, but the 73-year-old comedian has never spoken publicly about his wife's health battle. However, the former Hollywood host has often affectionately mentioned his wife on The Tonight Show, which he hosted between 1992 and 2009, and then again between 2010 and 2014. Mavis has also accompanied her husband to red carpet events, most recently last November when they attended the Improv Comedy Club's 60th anniversary show in Hollywood. During an appearance on The Kelly Clarkson Show last year, Jay shared his secret to a long-lasting marriage. I think the cool thing I found out about you too is you and Mavis, your wife of 40 years, which yeah, is yeah. crazy. Yeah. Like, why is that crazy? It's you crazy. Got, no, no, that is crazy. Because well, that why is that crazy? It doesn't exist anymore. Oh, Everybody sure has a fight. Oh, there are plenty of people. No, no, we have a great time. You have to marry a normal person. That's the best. <laughs> no, 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 I mean that because I meet guys all the time, you know, and they'll say, I met this girl. She's crazy, but the sex is unbelievable. It's unbelievable, you know? <laughs> and I go to them, yeah, you're right. But when the sex is over, she's still crazy. Okay? <laughs> So now you have 23 hours of crazy until your good crazy hour comes back again. <laughs> so it depends how long you can go. And, and you know, and the trick is just, you know what I say? It, it, it's, it's, a quote I, it's a quote I gave to Drew Barrymore because she asked me this question. I said, always marry your conscience. Marry the person you wish you could be, you know, who was kind and maybe whatever faults you have doesn't have those faults. And that's worked out for me. So to me, I, I married that's the perfect really person. That's really good advice. Yeah, it worked out good. Yeah, yeah. That's amazing. Oh, yeah, yeah.